Hi, I'm Brandi Suchevich. I'm an elementary school music teacher, and today I'll be showing you how to make maracas. You'll need cups, markers, tape, preferably masking tape, and some small noisemakers such as popcorn kernels. For this activity, you start with your, paper, your cups. It's best to use plastic instead of paper or styrofoam because plastic makes the best sound. And um, you start by putting one cup the regular way, and then you take your popcorn kernels. You can put as many or as few as you like. But two capfuls is really the best. The more or less kernels you put in, it makes a little bit different sound for your maraca. Next, you take your second cup and place it over top of the first one, upside down. You want to make sure that all the sides are lined up so that your kernels can't fall out. Then you take masking tape and tape it all around the sides. You want to make sure you don't leave any spaces open. Now masking tape is my favorite tape to use just because it's white and it's really easy to color over top of. So when you're decorating your maraca, you can really color over it and make your decorations a little better. And whenever you use um, markers on masking tape, it doesn't blend in quite as much as other tape does. If you use your fingers on it, it won't smear. So once you put your tape on, your maraca is roughly done. You have your sound to it. But next you want to do your decorating. You can take any, any kind of markers you want. Um, permanent markers are the best because again, they won't smear. And you can color them however you want. Put squiggles, faces, your name. Make sure you color over the tape too so that it's, it's a lot nicer looking. And once you put on your decorations, you're ready to make some music. That's how you make a maraca.